Well, I was supposed to make this video a long fucking time ago, but... <laughs> okay, hi there. By now, I assume you have watched all the episodes of Raiders of the Lost Ark, Seekers of the Scene, which if you have, thank you. If you haven't, then what the fuck are you watching the last episode for? This is something that I wanted to do for a very long time, but YouTube copyright laws got in the way, but now finally, apparently I can do it, and they won't bitch about it, so yay. This is a brief video just regarding something about Raiders of the Lost Ark as a whole, and it actually comes from an episode of The Big Bang Theory. Supposedly they stirred some controversy when some characters on the show said that Indiana Jones didn't really do anything to save the day. The Nazis were digging in the wrong place in the beginning, and they were going to die anyway from all the shit in the Ark that kills them, you know. But this annoys me for two reasons. First reason, simply put, this is all in hindsight. Nobody knew what the Ark was going to do. So kind of arguing that, oh, everyone would have died anyway is just kind of moot because you should just admire what they were, what everyone was trying to do to get to that point, regardless of what was inside. It's like saying if on Deal or No Deal, you know, that game show where you'd say, oh, I should have picked the other case. I mean, it's not going to change anything. It doesn't really matter by now. Second, and most importantly, Raiders of the Lost Ark when it was first released, it didn't have the title Indiana Jones and until later on with Temple of Doom and Last Crusade. When Raiders of the Lost Ark was released, it was just called Raiders of the Lost Ark. Now, the point of that is that this movie is not just about Indy. It's about people who are trying to get to the Ark. Multiple people. You have Belloc, you have the Nazis, you have Indy. Everyone has an opinion on the Ark. Nazis wanted power, Belloc wanted glory, Sala didn't even want it opened. He he was the person who was like, you know, ignorance is bliss, whatever, don't open it. And Indy at the end just wanted his girl back. You see, Indy was just one of many of the raiders. The real heroic feat is that he survived. We were led to believe throughout the movie that he was just another scumbag treasure hunter. But then at the end, when he's tied up with Marion and all the ghosts are about to come out, he finally gave in to respecting those supernatural powers that he never believed in. Why? Because he wanted his girl Marion. He wanted her back. And that's really the point of the story. That's really the development there. Forget the Ark. The Ark is just a MacGuffin, which in film lingo means an object that drives the plot. The Ark is something that all the characters drive towards. But the movie isn't actually about the Ark itself, nor is it really about rescuing the Ark. It's about the people who are trying to get to the Ark. So trying to minimize the movie by saying, oh yeah, if Indy didn't really do anything, just kind of misses the whole point of the movie. But then all of this is ruined by good old George Lucas when he made Temple of Doom a prequel, which makes no sense because by the time Raiders of the Lost Ark happened, Indy should have learned his lesson from T Temple of Doom. So if you want to be mad at anybody, just get mad at George Lucas, like always.